Well, let me be crystal clear. I think experience is vastly overrated when it comes to a tech startup. That um, I think that, and there are zero VCs who are going to agree with most of what I'm going to say now. But I think that the sweet spot for a tech entrepreneur is, shall I, shall I be ages and racist, or just ages, or just racist? Um, I think the sweet spot is someone in their 20s in an engineering curriculum at Stanford, MIT, Carnegie Mellon, you know, you pick a school. That's the sweet spot. And, and if, you, if you look at the great companies that truly changed the world, if you looked at the founding team, the first two or three employees, they were unproven, absolutely unproven. Not only were they unproven, they were clueless. They, they had no idea how hard it would be to do what they're going to do. And so that's why at 50, I have no desire to be a CEO anymore. I do not want to be a CEO. I will never start another company. I actually have three startups, Nick, Noah, and Noemi. They are 3, 9, and 11. And when they graduate college, I'm going to have three IPOs. You know? but, but so see, when you get to be like 50, you know how hard it is to do everything. And you know how there are other important things in the world. So I think you need to start the company now, when you're like this age. Because you have nothing to lose, and you don't know how hard it is. <laughs> and, and once you have a lot to lose, and you know how hard it is, you're not going to do it. You're going to hedge your bet. You're going to wish you went to work for Morgan Stanley. So, <laughs> so you need to do it now. You know, I, when I was evangelizing Macintosh, it was 1984, so I was 30. So I really didn't know anything yet. And, and that was, ignorance is not only bliss, it is also empowering. So if today someone said, you know, guy, we're going to start a new company. It's going to have a new personal computer operating system. And based on your track record with Macintosh, we think you really know how to evangelize a new operating system. So we want you to become, you know, either CEO or whatever, CMO or whatever, you know, chief evangelist officer, because we want you to repeat the Macintosh phenomenon of getting all this great software. There is not enough money printed to make me do that. Because I know, having done it with Macintosh, how hard it would be. So you need to find someone like me who doesn't know that to do that. But I have too much knowledge. I am too smart to do something that hard. So that's why, that's why I think the great companies are with young people who don't know how hard it is. Because if you knew, you wouldn't do it.